Good morning and welcome to another Fun Friday video from 303 Tech. I'm Clint Larson. Today we'd like to talk a little bit about uh, matching your technical needs with the computers that are available. Um, some people go out there and they look for the cheapest computer that they can find and say, oh, that's it, it's, I'm good. And it really doesn't work that way. I mean, it might for a little bit, but then you're going to have problems down the road. It's not going to have the longevity you need or the power that you possibly need. So it's really important to match your needs with what you purchase. Um, some of the things out there are processor, i5, i7, AMD. Um, you need to take a look at those. There's a lot of um, processors, especially the Intel, that says i5, okay, I'm good with i5, but you need to understand that there's generations of that i5. I think we're up to generation 12 now. So if you get an i5 computer or i5 processor, what generation is it? Is it generation four? Not gonna do it. Is it generation 10? Mm, it might. Generation 12, that's the latest and greatest, but do you really need that? Then you need to talk, think about RAM. RAM used to be four gigabytes of RAM, used to be pretty good and take care of you. These days we're recommending at least 16. Then you need to take a look at video cards. Are you gonna be in a graphic intense environment doing photography or art studios or that kind of stuff, or is it just gonna be your office programs? You know, so then you need to take a look at those. So it's really important to match what your needs are with what's available. Because paying for something that you're not gonna utilize, like a really heavy duty graphics card and all you're gonna do is print Word documents, you might be overspending. Another place that you need to take a look at is the operating system. There's several different flavors of Windows out there now. We recommend at least getting Windows Professional. Don't go with Windows Home. I mean, although even if it's for a home computer, there's a bunch of additional security features that are available in um, the professional operating system. So we definitely recommend going that way. And if for some reason it needs to be brought into the office environment, you're already ready and available. So anyway, there's some things that you can think of. If you have any questions or want any additional information, please let us know. Here at 303 Tech, we like to keep you simply connected. Thank you.